Just a yellow. Oh, damn! <laughs> She's serving up a good portion of stew. What's up, you guys? It's your boy Perverted Senpai here, and today we're gonna be reacting to the girl I like forgot her glasses, episode two. On our last episode, we got to see our boy Komura actually get to have a conversation with the girl Mai. Seeing how Mai is somewhat more different, but still very adorable to see. Of course, our boy Komura can't like you know hide his blushiness and would die from it. But of course, with this title of this anime. It all means that this girl is going to keep forgetting her glasses from each episode from here on out. And it also means our boy Komura may be needing to help her out seeing or doing things in class. With that said, if you guys happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode, hit that like button if you guys want to see my reaction on the next episode. Hit the subscribe button if you guys haven't already. But that's pretty much all I got to talk about. Let's hop on to today's episode. Alright. Our boy, he is serving lunch for today. Oh, with Mai as well. <laughs> oh yeah i wonder how Maya is gonna pull this off if she's gonna be able to serve the right amount of food to the person just a yellow oh damn <laughs> she's serving up a good portion of stew Ooh. oh oh shit okay banger intro banger intro oh bro these moments bro these moments i can't wait so, once again, my forgot her glasses. And of course, yes, last episode she had like contact lenses, but doesn't mean that they could wear them all the time. Dude, I mean, I would want her to serve me a good portion. God damn. Alright, how's our boy gonna support her? How's he gonna do it? Hmm. Take over the stew, eh? It's funny how the music just stops. So she's proud to be the stew person, I see. <laughs> Talking like a warrior. Just a tiny bit. That's a tiny bit. Bro, you're making him starve. <laughs> I'm starting to get hungry. <laughs> I can't wait to have stew. <laughs> she's going to serve herself a big portion, that's for sure. I actually prefer curry. <laughs> Boy, he's going to lie. <laughs> They give me extra meal. Hey, hey, yo, calm down, man, Mr. Fatty Guy. Hmm? Oh, is she actually gonna do it? I'll do that next time. Do it next time. Give her, give him a lot of potatoes. I'm pretty sure she's not gonna give him potatoes at all. Hey. That's not potatoes, is it? Oh, yeah, that's meat. <laughs> Everything that my say says she's gonna do does exactly the opposite. <laughs> On a day's work. Man, must have been rough. Ah, so that's why she wanted to give him a bunch of potatoes. She wanted the meat for herself. Oh, she wanted to give him the meat. I'm pretty sure it's potatoes, I bet. <laughs> so that's her way of saying thanks to what he did the other day. I see. How nice of her. Able to keep that promise. Nice. Oh, he loves it now. He loves stew. Ah, <laughs> uh, yep. Potatoes. <laughs> Uh, but he's still gonna enjoy it because he got served by Mai. Hmm? Wait, what did she... One day contacts. Oh, man. If no one has ever wore contact lens, they're a pain. They're just a pain. Let me just tell you. Yep, she's basically telling us the trauma and the PTSD that someone gets from wearing contact lens. I don't know if it's a good idea for her to use them because seeing how she forgets her glasses when she forget that she would have contact lens on her eyes the whole time. I'll protect you. Hey. Hey, there we go. Our boy. And he's sitting in front of the whole class. Aw, she's so happy about it. <laughs> it just echoes forever and ever. <laughs> Hey, she got her glasses. Oh, wait, the glasses got foggy. Oh. There's a stranger in our class. What? Wait, so she can only tell people by the eyes? That is very strange. 
As long as you recognize me. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, that's another echo through his heart. <laughs> I'm still severe in the moment. Don't stop me yet. <laughs> oh, damn. They're already exchanging contact information. Let's go. As many time as you liked. <laughs> uh, so, wait. Is she going to ask him to help her not forget? Another echo through his heart. <laughs> true, true. If you've already seen her multiple times for getting her glasses, it makes logical sense. But to our Kumara, it's very touching. Emotional moment. Yo, he's getting cru- I mean, Texas from his crush? Awesome. Amazing. <laughs> he even fell out of his bed. <laughs> yeah, you know, I think the second episode, the animation has settled down a bit, which is nice. Not like crazy, like movement around the animation with that said we get our fantastic girl that forgot her glasses <laughs> she fell asleep on a train <laughs> like i lost them <laughs> maybe you're not cut out wearing glasses perhaps there is somewhere i must be i must ask you to take me there hey okay looks like they're going on a yellow adventure we're in town together. Yep, yep. Connect, connect. On a date. <laughs> My boy just being hella happy right now. <gasps> Looks like they're gonna be holding hands, my guy. <laughs> Wait, did he pass out while I was standing up? <laughs> my death? Wait, what? My death couldn't have been more than a day or two away. <laughs> Dude, the pressure, the pressure is on. Will my boy be able to hold his emotions underground while holding this girl's hand? Hmm. So they're gonna have a little nice snack. Nice. I wonder what girl doesn't like cake. I've yet to encounter that person. Oh, <laughs> what? Oh, looks like uh, our boy is gonna have to feed her. Oh no, don't give me that sad face. Nice. Good idea. Good idea. Damn. All right. She just like said, go on ahead. She has no nerves, my guy. Shouldn't I visit her home <laughs> every single her father's blessing first? <laughs> I mean, technically, yeah. <laughs> What's wrong is for this to go on. Right. He must feed her so that she could close her mouth. Nice. Success. I picture her my way. <laughs> I picture her father in my mind and beg for his mercy. I, I remember that. <laughs> That's always funny whenever he brings that up. Oh, so she was heading to the glasses shop. Oh, so she bought new ones. I see. Uh, no more hand holding, Sag. I see all. I see everything. Ah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> wait. I cannot wash my hands. What do you mean? <laughs> Hey, 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 she wants you to stay around. Now that I can finally see you. <laughs> this is why I like girls with glasses, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's real life, bro. He was able to go out with a girl that he likes. See, a lot of people won't understand. To her... She thinks that she's like bothering him, but to him, it's a god blessing. <laughs> looking at him, truly was looking at him. Uh, yes, we're back to school. But let me guess, she forgets her glasses, right? Oh, oh, she didn't. And that was a freaky soundtrack. I like it. What is she doing? She must have went to a pervy bookstore, right? Oh, she just has a code. Mm, I like those glasses of hers. <laughs> it reminds me of me. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't be like that. No, there's no way he would think like that. Uh, <laughs> just because of that, she took off her glasses. I forgot them. Bro, how are you going to lie to him? 
<laughs> Boys, we'll never understand girls. <laughs> Time to review today's episode. So in the beginning of the episode, we get to see my serving people stew, a good portion of it too. But also the painting, like, you know, of our boy Komora letting her know that she's like serving too much or too little. There are times that, you know, she may starve some of the people that are getting the food portion. <laughs> and whenever she talks like, you know, a samurai, oh man, those are like the best moments right there. And I'm pretty sure like every time time that Mai says something like not confident say something nice to our boy Komura he's gonna definitely take that not well maybe yes like a misunderstanding but like he's gonna take it to the heart that's for sure and of course the people that are like complaining or arguing about the content lens there's gonna be a specific time where you can't like you know reuse them or use them for a specific day so you can't wear them all the time kind of a pain to put them on your eye and even worse when you have to like take it out and that's if you actually remember it to pull them out because if you like leave them on during the night and you wake up they're gonna be dry and it's gonna be very painful to pull them out but of course as everybody's preference and if they want to wear glasses or content lens for our girl Mai she preferred glasses and that's why she wants to wear glasses instead of contact lens but of course she forgets her glasses and also another thing that I did see in today's episode was the foggy glasses yes foggy glasses are kind of a pain to be honest especially during you know 2020 when COVID was happening and we all had a wear a mask it was a pain my glasses would always fog up a lot like a lot and we also got to see my asking Komura if they want to exchange contact information which was a huge success because later on they ended up going on a practical date as you can say seeing how our girl forgot her glasses on the train so her only hope was to ask Komura to help her take her to where she needed to go of course there's that sidetrack of them you know eating some cakes and <laughs> let's just say that was fun to watch and also at the very end of the episode we get to see Mai having a mask and the glasses that are foggy and it just reminds me of those type of tropes in anime when we see someone going into a story and getting something that they're not necessarily supposed to get considering how old they are and so that left uh, our girl Mai hiding her glasses even though she had her glasses on and our boy Komura saw them <laughs> So she just lied to him, even though he knew what the truth was. With that said, if you guys happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode, hit that like button if you guys want to see my reaction on the next episode. Hit that subscribe button if you guys haven't already. But that's pretty much all I'm going to talk about. It's been your boy Perez Senpai, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.